Joining us now is Amanda DeBoer, the volunteer coordinator of the Rotaract Club of Red Deer. Now, you have a very exciting event happening right here at Bo's Restaurant on September 18th that the Rotaract Club is putting on. So first, before we talk about the event, what is the Rotaract Club of Red Deer? Uh, the Rotary Club of Red Deer is a service organization where a group of young professionals between the ages of 18 and 30, basically the stepping stone to the Rotary Club and Rotary International. Uh, basically what we do is we put forth our energy into volunteer events, um, things like the food bank, uh, the river cleanup that we had just this summer, um, and we also host events like this as a means of raising funds to put back into the community. That's fantastic. So let's talk about the event. It's happening in just a few short weeks. Uh, what's going on? So what guests can expect is when they come in, they're going to be greeted by some very enthusiastic Rotaract volunteers. Uh, they're going to get a passport, which will enable them to circle around the venue and uh, visit each of our vendors. Each vendor is going to be supplying four wings from four categories four times. So everyone's going to get 16 wings total, very much competition-worthy wings. We have four different categories that they're competing in the Stantec Heat to Beat, uh, the Best Traditional, which is sort of a spin on the salt and pepper, honey garlic, but making it competition worthy. Uh, we have the Most Original, which our vendors are really taking to new heights and creating some awesome recipes for, and the Best Dry Rub. Um, afterwards, we're going to have silent auction. There is a 50-50 raffle a booze bucket raffle and a um, wine tree raffle, as well as entertainment. We have One Day in May performing for us. They're donating their, their vocals for our event. Um, and we have some celebrity judges who will ultimately be voting for the winner, as well as a People's, People's Choice Award. So lots of stuff going on. Where's the money that's raised at this Chicken Wing Festival going to? So we have a lot of uh, opportunities happening right now. The Rotaract Club is completely uh, a volunteer club. So we have no expensive staff to pay for, which means all the money we raise goes back into the community. Um, now, the best thing about our club is that the, peop the members are able to propose which volunteer organizations they want to donate to. For example, one of our members um, requested that we donate to Tools for Schools in Lacombe which we did just last month. Um, another member is proposing that we donate to the Carrywood Nature Center because they're building a, um, a playground and garden, so we want to support them as well. Um, moreover, we have to recognize that the Rotaract Club is a part of a much bigger world community, so we are involved with Rotary International. And they have a, a partner club right now in the Philippines who are in desperate need of water wells. So that is a, a big drive for us right now. We want to make sure that their community has fresh and clean drinking water. So uh, that'll be where our money is going as well. That's fantastic. So what do people need to know if they want to help your cause and come to the very first Chicken Wing Festival? Um, well, they can definitely uh, start by getting tickets. Uh, you can come to Bo's Bar and Grill and purchase them from any of the staff here, the bartenders. Uh, we also have a Facebook page, the Rotaract Facebook page, or the Wing Fest Facebook page. Um, so that's one of the easiest ways to get in contact with us. Um, and certainly, we are still collecting silent auction prizes. So if people want to help us out, uh, they can do that to the bitter end so please do help by donating or by purchasing tickets well great thank you so much for speaking with us and telling us more a little a little bit more about your event who doesn't want to help out a good cause and eat chicken wings in the process it all happens september 18th